In this video I will show you how to edit your Sony a7 III footage in a really simple way with just a few simple adjustments to white balance, exposure, saturation and sharpness. You can improve the look of the footage uh, really really much in just small simple tweaks. So let's do it. Start by uh, starting DaVinci Resolve. This program is free to download, link in the description. And first thing we want to do is to reset the layout. So you and me have the same uh, layout in DaVinci Resolve. And then we will import media, find your clip, I think that's the one. Drag it into your timeline. Let's just trim this a bit. Like this. I think that's enough. And then let's start uh, color grading this. Go to color. First thing I want to do is set the white balance. If you have something that you see is totally white in the picture, you can select this tool, press it, and then press the, click on the white in the footage. I don't really see anything that I would say is white right in this picture but we can try it just so you, so you see how it works so okay maybe this is a bit white and then you can see that it changes the color so it sets the white balance after the pixel I select in the image but I didn't really like that so I will press command C and I will then set the white balance manually and for that we have this tool temperature and tint uh, so basically if you want it a little more like uh, sunrise, sunset, then you can pull it a bit more to the yellow. I think that looks kind of weird and more towards the blue and that's a bit too much blue. I would say this image, maybe it's good as it is. About the tint, I would maybe like a little bit more purple in it because I think it's too green. Yeah, something like that. And now to the exposure. We have uh, lift to lift up the shadows. So if it's too dark, we can lift it. Or if the shadows is a bit too bright, we can lower it a bit. I think this is, this is better. It's a uh, better contrast in the dark. Uh, gamma is like the, the shadows. So we can try lift it. Nah, lower it. Yeah, something like that, I think. And then gain. And this is like the highlights. Drag it up a bit. And offset is like the overall exposure. So pull it up, looks like this. Down, yeah, maybe like this. And to see before and after, you can press uh, the number here. That's before and that's after. And now to saturation. This is uh, the saturation. I like to start with the 65 and just see how it looks like and yeah maybe a bit too much it's easy to overdo it so let's maybe 60 is better and then for sharpness I always always I don't know why but 47 is always on point for for my footage so pull this down until you see 47 and that's it before after before after so let's export this quick export uh, h 264 make sure the resolution matches uh, the camera settings so 4k and 25 fps export crow and that's how you do it. That's how you edit your Sony a7 III footage in the most uh, simple way. Uh, as you can see, small changes uh, uh, made pretty big difference. 